Hello everyone, um, my name is Joaquin, and today, um, it's a, I know you guys have been wanting to know, wait a minute, where's episode 8 of Spider Abbey? Well, it's still in the works, it's just that we're having a struggle with voice actors and stuff, so, like I said, we're, we're gonna get this episode released as soon as possible, like I said, and I know I always say that a lot, but I really mean it this time. It's just that we have a lot of holdbacks and stuff, so... But yeah, I just wanted to make this video just to show you about um, Spider Abbey and what created it. And also, of course, I wanted to show you some of the stuff that, well, not stuff, I mean, Spider Abbey stuff. You know what I mean? So anyways, oh, my finger's in the way. So let me go ahead and show you the first, um, let me go ahead and first off show you my uh, new figure for that I'm about to use for my stop motion later on in the series, which is Spider Abbey in her third version of the suit so I don't know if you guys can see but let me go ahead and light this up just you can get to see um, I know you guys can't see because it's a little bit blurry and the camera won't yeah the camera won't pick won't focus on that so yeah so this is spider Abby and of course I had to use a, a dark hair brown hair piece to paint uh, some of the areas um, and as you can see um, uh, some of the paint is starting to really fall apart on me. Um, I'm supposed to make the hair on Burnett brown, but I guess I can't. I'm just going to have to repaint that again. So, but yeah, look at this. Um, so, the black lines are supposed to be the web pattern. Um, like I said, I'm a new per I'm new to this, so don't judge me. Um, the black on the sides right here is, well, she is a girl, so I put those black lines for a reason. I know most new figures are supposed to have that, so yeah. I will do, um, you know, muscle designs on it too, so yes. Hopefully. Um, but this is a, des so yeah, that's Spider Abby. And I already made a third design suit of her um, in my uh, design book. Um, which so happens I have. Um... Oh my goodness, yep. Yeah. Here it is. This is the third design. So that's what the figure's supposed to be. Um, that white spider is like the the new spider logo for Spider Abbey. It's just that I put that... L and it kind of reminds you guys of the Venom logo. I love the logo and I thought, you know what? Let's put that on Spider Abbey on the newer design of the suit. So that's why... I, that, so that's what I did, so... Yeah, and of course you got the traditional webbing pattern, and that will be the new back spider, so that will be really cool to see. So yeah, that's Spider Abbey, of course, if you guys want to know. Um, oops, sorry about that one. Um, there are some other, and I wanted to show you guys, um, you guys are wondering what's this yellow bag here. This is where I have some uh, comic designs and failures of mine that I'm trying to make a Spider Abbey. Um, like I said, I wanted, uh, the first start, I always wanted to create, uh, Spider Abby, my very own character to her, my very first, uh, comic book character I made it to make more of a design. Now, you guys probably know, for us comic book geeks, we already know that Spider-Man has a sister is now a thing, and, you know, Spider-Girl's been a thing for a while, like, a real long time, and I thought, you know what, let's add another dimensional spider into the mix, and then... It takes place in Earth 182, um, which is, I don't know, I don't know of any universe in the Marvel Universe it ha has that, but I don't know. It's Earth 182. Um, it's somewhat like the 616 era, but different. Everything's different. Um, this is the universe where Peter Parker isn't a Spider-Man. He isn't even Spider-Man at all. He doesn't get bit by the radioactive spider. The sister of Peter Parker gets bit by the spider, and her name is Abigail Mary Parker. Um, Abigail Parker, so, and then when she gets bit by the spider, she, um, she becomes Spider Abby, of course, and then instead of Uncle Ben dying from being killed by the murderer, it was Peter who gets killed by the murderer. I know people are like, oh, come on, really? But, I mean, you know, it has to go that way, I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, um, this is my pre-comic design that I'm making. Uh, I know it's just not much, but I don't know. I'm trying to make, but yeah, like I said, I'm kind of new to this, so um, 
I'm gonna do my best. But yeah, that's the comic design. Um, those will be changed later on. Um, so yeah, that's yeah. Those are my comic uh, orders. Uh, comic, uh, my pre-comic that I'm pretty much making. And me and my sister and my my sister Melissa and my brother, uh, not my brother, my friend, Caden and I were we are already having our brains, uh, our minds working to uh, make brainstorming ideas for the stories and whatnot. So, yeah, basically we're pretty much in production already. So we just need to go ahead and start making this all, making this. And of course, I have the fourth issue, which is in my book in my bag right here. Um, it's not fully finished, it's just that, you know, it's not fully finished, it's just that, yeah, it's just not that fully finished, uh, you know, but, you know, <clears throat> that's, um, how I got into Spider Abbey. Um, oh yeah, I didn't get you the full story of behind it. Now, uh, I was talking to my friend on to one of my best friends, and she was, I told, I told her, like, what would you be like if Spider, what would you, what would, it be, what would you be like if you were Spider-Man, and she was like, well, it would be fun, and you were like, oh, that's cool, you'll be, you will like, fight, fight villains, like Venom, Green Goblin, and save people, stop crime, and she was like, she was into the idea, and then, that's something that popped in my head, and I remember, like, I, I put the pieces together in my head like, wait a minute, I could make my own Spider Abby character, my own Spider Girl character, and like, like, we already know Peter Parker's sister is now a thing, and Spider Girl's been a thing for some time, so I was like, you know what, I'm gonna combine the two to make it look like the sister of Peter Parker from another universe is, is Spider Girl, so... And then she donned herself a new name to herself, Spider Abby, that's why... My, Spider Abby was created, so, yeah, um, but yeah, that is Spider Abby, um, of course, and I'm going to be, uh, making, uh, fully pledged, um, I'm start making, uh, once I get episode 8 released, we will start working on episode 9, and then later on, episode 10, and then 11, and 12, and then we'll move on to season 2, which will be, will be much more fun, and, yeah, I hope we can get this and get it to season two so we can go ahead and get up and working and stuff. So, but yeah. And I want to give a big thanks to my friend, uh, to a fellow YouTuber and also a voice actor named Rubber Bubble, uh, Rubber Bubble Rap, who kindly want to join the voice for Venom. And I wanted to say thank you. If you're watching this, thank you very much for joining, for joining our cast it's such an honor to have you as our voice actor as for Venom, and yeah. So yeah, he's gonna be the main actor. Well, the main voice actor for Venom. Um, well, we're, I'm still working on somebody to work for, to voice Jackson Brock. Um, I'm already making. I already have a list of characters that, uh, one of my friends who will be helping out on this project to voice act as well. Um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you if you do like it, please thumbs it up. If you didn't, make feel free to thumbs it down. If you if you're not a subscriber, consider subscribing already and and like this video and share it, guys, because it would because I wanted to spread some light out there and I know there are difficult times right now, but I wanted to spread some light and just to let you know that we're all in this together, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and yeah, I'll see you guys later. Thank you, and peace.